Okay, so I made this uh, script here, Material Tween. Um, it allows you to uh, tween multiple attributes on the all-in-one shader uh, pretty easily, uh, but it also uses do tween. So you're going to want to have do tween as well as the all-in-one shader. And let me give you just an example of how this works. I'll press play. Um, and basically what it does is it takes the original material, it makes a duplicate of it so that uh, you can use the same material on different objects and the different objects will have different behavior. Uh, then you can create an element in this array for each attribute that you would like to tween. So uh, right now I have shine location and glow. If I wanted to turn off the glow, I can press one to make it so it's just shine location. Okay, and if I wanted to change the speed or the delay, I can make it faster by going um, lower number here. I can change the value. So if I just wanted to go halfway across, I can do that. Or if I wanted to start at half and end at like full, then we'll do it like that. Um, yeah, I can end at one, start at zero, and I can yo-yo instead, which means it'll go back and forth, which is nice. Um, or I can add another element here. And instead of shine location, let's say maybe I want to change uh, glow like I did before. So I use underscore glow. And it's important to note that these can be found in the documentation. So uh, if I bring up the documentation here, which comes with that asset, we have things like hit effect blend and, and it's underscore hit effect blend. So let's do that one because we already saw a glow. Let's see, hit effect blend, and we'll change hit effect blend from zero to a hundred, and we'll make it yo-yo in like a second. Uh, now they it does have to be on, so hit effect is going to be somewhere over here, right here. You can see that it is tweening though. Okay, it's, it's tweening too much. Uh, oh, I think that's because hit effect blend probably goes from zero to one. Yep. So if I make that really short, it's gonna strobe. And I can change the color, obviously, and do all these other things. <clears throat> and you can feel free to modify this script however you like, but I thought that it would be pretty neat uh, to put together something that tweens multiple values uh, with relative ease. You know, it's not perfect, but I think it's pretty good. All right, enjoy.